What's up everybody, it's me Blake316 here with another video for you guys. In this video is going to be another video game recent pickups, other, another episode of I Got Game. Basically where I show you guys my recent video game pickups. And in my opinion, 2018 has not been a great year for gaming. I haven't been picking up much. Reason being, a lot of the games coming out, I just don't really have any interest in it. But with that being said, there, there were still some games here and there that came out that I definitely wanted. And like I said, I'm going to be showing you guys my recent gaming pickups. Now, one of the game, well, the first game I'm going to show you guys is a game that I definitely was interested in for a long time. And it finally came out on the newer console, so I definitely picked it up. And that is Dragon's Crown Pro. I was always interested in Dragon's Crown when it came on the PlayStation 3. Um, the reason being, I always liked the art style, but I was never a big PlayStation 3 gamer, so when this was announced for the PlayStation 4 Pro, I definitely picked it up, and I'm definitely enjoying this game. I knew I would. I really like the art style. I've been playing this game. I stopped playing because I got to the point where I have to grind, and this is like an RPG game, and I don't really like grinding too much, so I kind of took a break from it, but I'm definitely going to get back to it because I really enjoy this game. This game has awesome art, and it's just a really fun game. And I definitely recommend it if you like um, RPGs. Uh, like I said, Dragon's Crown, Dragon's Crown Pro for the PlayStation 4. Another game that I picked up that I actually already own on the Wii U, but I've also picked it up for the Nintendo Switch, is Donkey Kong Country Freeze. Um, yes, I own the Wii U version, but guess what? I wanted the Nintendo Switch version because I really enjoyed the game that much. Obviously, this, this game does have the new uh, funky mode with uh, the new character ad added to it. Does it make a huge di difference? No. If you already own the, uh, the Wii U version, should you buy this version? You don't really have to, but I wanted it, and I'm definitely happy with my purchase. So Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Another game that I picked up that I've had my eyes on for quite some time, but I did not want to pay full price for it. And it is Tokyo Mirage Sessions uh, for the Nintendo Wii U. I've always wanted this game, but I never wanted to play $60 because I didn't know if I was definitely going to like it or not. I've yet to play it, it's still sealed, and the reason why I finally picked it up, because Best Buy had it on sale for, I believe, $14 or $15, and that was definitely a deal that I could not pass on, because like I said, I wanted it for so long, as soon as I seen it, I had to grab it, and it was the last copy too, so I'm glad I finally got this game, and it's definitely something I want to get to, but I just haven't got to yet, Tokyo Sessions, uh, Tokyo Mirage Sessions, another game that I picked up, I had a GameStop gift card, and I was just looking to spend it. And this game looked kind of interesting. I don't really know much about it other than just seeing it in like maybe a, a YouTube review or something. And it is Owlboy for the Nintendo Switch. Like I said, this is definitely a game I didn't know much about, but I had a gift card and I wanted to spend it. And this is probably something I definitely would not have ever picked up unless I had uh, the gift card. So I picked it up and it's Owlboy on the Nintendo Switch. I believe it's a, a, a platformer, 2D, really artistic. Hopefully it's good. Not not a big deal another game that I picked up that I definitely wanted and I'm glad it finally came out is Sega Genesis classics I really like these games because for 30 bucks you literally just get 50 games so you can't really go wrong and granted if you don't like all 50 you're definitely gonna like at least one or two and definitely on this on these uh on this disc I definitely like more than one or two but this is something I wanted to pick up let's play a bunch of retro games whether it's Sonic, Shoot Your Rage, uh, Final Fantasy not Final Fantasy um, what the hell is the name of that? Final Fantasy. Uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Uh, what's it called? Uh, Fantasy Star. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, but this is something I picked up and definitely not regret regretting it. Another game that I picked up that I absolutely love, and this is probably my favorite game right now, is the Street Fighter 30th Anniversary Collection. This, in my opinion, is by far one of the best collections, uh, uh, collaborations out period whether it's Street Fighter or any other collections for any other games this is really good I've definitely been playing through all the Street Fighters the online mode is really fun playing against other people in my opinion it works really well and this is obviously a great game I definitely think this is a must buy if you like fighters or especially Street Fighter I picked this up the same day that I actually picked up that Sonic Collection uh, game and last but not least I picked up God of War for the PlayStation 4 I made quite a few videos on this game stating my opinion. I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not a big fan of it. I did not finish it. I, I'm gonna, I guess I'll tell you guys I took a break. <laughs> um, but yeah, God of War for PlayStation 4. I had to pick it up, AAA, uh, PlayStation 4 exclusive. You know, I definitely had experienced it for myself. It's definitely one of the best looking visual games I've ever played. It looks really good, but 
you know, it, it just, for me, it wasn't my kind of game. I, like I said, I'm not gonna go too much detail because I made quite a few videos on it. I'm hoping I'll go back to it. But as you can see here, got plenty of games for plenty or literally all the different platforms, whether it's PlayStation 4, Nintendo Switch, Xbox One, it definitely pays not to be a, a PlayStation or Xbox One or Nintendo Switch fanboy. Play games that you like, got all these pickups. But anyway, it's me, Blake doing 6 here with the new video of I Got Game, new episode. Make sure to subscribe to future videos, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all that good stuff. Peace.